Coming up, fixing your Elegumar's Z problem with binding may be a different issue. Stay tuned. Hey everybody, Chris Sergeant Taz here, and today I'm going to go over like why your rod is binding. It may not be just grease. It might be a bigger issue. Um, my Elegoo Mars is about seven years, seven months old, um, and I had an issue where, for some unknown reason, it just stopped moving. I couldn't figure out what was up. So taking it apart, it's all one piece. So your Z rod and your stepper motor are all one piece. There's no coupler to take it apart. Um, so when I took the house, it was locked up. I couldn't figure out why it wasn't working. So I took it apart. What I found, this bearing seized, won't turn. So that's a problem. Um, it subsequently overheated the motor, and I don't know if it can get on the camera or not, but it separated a portion of the stepper right, get right in through here. It split the magnet. So obviously it was blown. They did send me a new one. So in the next clip or so, I'm gonna show you how to replace this whole piece pretty easily. And then also a little ounce of prevention to um, prevent any resin from seeping down, which I thought was an initial problem. It wasn't, it's the bottom bearing, so it isn't the resin getting in here by accident or what have you. It's it's just a bad bearing. So, like I said, it just it didn't want to turn. You can hear it grinding. Yeah, that's no good. So it may not be the lubrication on your Z, it might be actually your stepper motor bearing on the very bottom or the top one locked up that's gripping that and then it'll seize up your motor so like i said the next section would be replacement i'll show you how i did that
the lip and stuck it in on, on my version that I did so that I wouldn't get any um, seepage of resin if, it, if I did get a droplet over there it's not going to go down the lead screw and into your motor so hopefully this helps you out and um, give you an idea what could go wrong and how to fix it as always thanks give me a like subscribe I appreciate it and see ya